All right, what's going on, everybody? Hope you're all having a great day. Thanks for coming back for another episode. So, oh, there's buzzards circling. That's never good. Anyway, sorry. Um, yeah, so we're back here. We're on the Big E property on the back side of it. Um, the past two days, I've seen two deer go from the front side to the back side. A lot of the deer seem to be traveling this way for some reason or another. I don't know why. So we're going to give another whirl back here. Uh, we sat here Monday night. That was the 21st. We were back here and uh, we've seen those doe and whatnot. But where there's doe, there is going to be eventually bucks. It's just it's the nature of the game. If you can find the doe, you will find bucks of some kind. So uh, we, have a tr uh, we have a trail camera to go check real quick. And then it's uh, time to get elevated. All right, after a little bit too much walking around trying to find a damn tree, I finally found one. The only issue is I'm gonna have one shot out into the field, that's pretty much it. I'm right on the boundary line behind me, like within probably 10 yards. I'm not even gonna take a chance of shooting that way. Uh, the only issue that I really, really have there's a tree stand that's in the field um, probably 70 yards away from me I don't know if that guy's coming to hunt tonight I'm not sure I don't want to cause an issue between him and me but you know I have permission to hunt the property so I'll see you guys in the tree all right just got up I actually really like this spot I'm tucked in just a little bit it's a little too open to be like perfect. Uh, I'll show you guys in a minute. The wind's in my favor. It's kind of like coming across my face here and blowing up. So if any deer come out of this corner like they did on Monday, they ain't gonna smell me, which is perfect. So that's the biggest thing right now. Like I stink. I just got off work, so I smell really bad. It's like 3.30 right now. It took us an hour to get in here. So I'm now all set up. So. I like this spot. I just hope the guy doesn't show up and uh, get pissed off that I'm near his tree stand, but I was here first. I mean, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know how I would feel. I always try to, you know, how would I feel if somebody did that to me? I don't know, man. I really don't know. So, if she shows up and gets mad, well, it is what it is. We have deer finally. They're not within bow range, but we have deer to look at. And that's a win.
So now we have five deer in the field. At least five deer that I can see. And uh, I noticed from last week, or from Monday to from Monday to today, they've all come out of the same exact spot. Every single deer. If I knew that guy wasn't gonna hunt, that would be a spot to go set up. But my luck, I'd go set up over there and he'd show up. He still might show up. I mean, the other night he came in here, it was like 5.40, marched right through the field and sat in his tree stand. So, it'd be nice if he didn't do that, but what are you gonna do, right?
obviously we have a pretty good plethora of, of deer here, so. Man, that got my heart pumping, man. Oh, what a great night. I mean, that was really good, guys. I mean, wow. A lot of deer. We had that little, little buck at the end, and after any kind of camera light, I had a buck come in. He was probably like 10 yards to my right, where those little button bucks had walked through earlier. Um, I, I couldn't count the points. It was so dark. It was like two minutes before the end of legal shooting light, and I couldn't make out what the hell he was, so I don't know where he was. I don't know what he was. I just have, I have no idea what he was, so, sucks, but you got to make sure they're legal here in PA, uh, where I live, they have to have three points on one side, uh, and I'm after something a little bit bigger than, you know, the first legal buck that walks by, so, but we finally, we're starting to get some good deer activity, finally, so, if you haven't already, click subscribe i would really appreciate it, guys i don't want anyone to miss any of the deer vlog this year uh rutcations coming up november 6th 7th and 8th i can't wait for that that is going to be unbelievable and uh hopefully i don't have a deer before or a buck before then so i can come out and film for you guys but all right i'll catch you guys on the next video see you then